The Akari Chargers finally barged into the win column, while the PLDT high-speed hitters halted the Cherry Tigo crossover's winning streak. Marty Bautista with the detail. Slow down. Cop goes to the middle. And once again. The Akari Chargers and Army Black Mamba were neck and neck in the opening moments of the first set in the PVL All-Filipino Conference. But through their steady offense, the Chargers were able to push ahead as a hit error from Army and a Din Din Manabat hit gave Akari the first frame. Din Din, not to with too much power, but in the end, they're gonna get this set. The Black Mamba put up a strong fight in the third set, breaking free of a 23-all deadlock to score the last two points. <laughs> Smart move there! But the Chargers made sure to take the fourth as a block from Princess Madrigal and a service ace iced the game. Oh, good serve. Is it going to be an ace? It is! <laughs> Final score 25-18, 25-19, 23-25 -20, 25 and 25-19. Manabat was stellar in Akari's win, putting up 23 points to lead all scorers. The win puts the Chargers in the win column as Army was kept winless in three games. Every time na sinasabi namin sa mga games namin, manalo lang kami ng isa, makuha lang namin yung momentum, magsusunod-sunod na, and alam namin na magigising yung teammates ko, or kami, na pag nakaset kami, talagang magdadere-derecho. We go back to Mayad Madres, finally, after two straight attack errors. In the second game, the PLDT high-speed hitters got everything going their way in the first set against the Cherry Tigo crossovers. While the team easily took the first frame, the next two frames were as tight as it can be. Leading 23-22, to 22, PLDT middle blocker Del Palomata drilled in two spikes to take the second set. The third set was close too and was tied at 25 apiece after a series of back and forths from both teams. Jovelin Prado, though, had enough of it and scored the last two points for the win. Final 25 to 13, 25 to 22, and 27 to 25. The high speed hitters took their second win and halted the three game winning streak of the crossovers. Four high speed hitters scored in double figures, led by Mary Ann Medreses, 14 points. PVL action resumes Thursday at the Phil Oil Eco Oil Center with the Choco Mucho Flying Titans taking on Army at 4 p.m. This will be followed by PLDT versus the Petrogas Angels at 6.30 p.m. For News 5, Marty Bautista, We Are One News.